What is up, guys? Welcome back for another episode here in Madden 17 Ultimate Team. Before I hop right into this gameplay, guys, I just want to show you all that I am in the playoffs right now. Um, if you didn't watch my, la my live stream from Wednesday night, that I, w I played like a bunch of games in my live stream and I was able to get to the playoffs during my live stream and shout out for everybody who showed up to my live stream i appreciate you guys so much but you see the record i believe i only lost two games my rewards um it says pro first string so i don't know how do i get ranked up higher I i'm not sure but if anybody knows let me know uh well here it is right here all madden first string i have to get basically undefeated i guess but i'm not sure how this works Division goals, seven wins, avoid demotion per game. Two. Okay, so if I want to be all Madden first string or all Madden however, how do I get to it, guys? Let me know down in the comment section. Um, before, oh, I'm 7-2 and two on the year. Uh, just to do a brief overview of the team, no changes have been made. Still the same team that I have from the video. From when i first got chad johnson although as i keep saying there will be more updates coming soon in, a, in the coming weeks guys so stay tuned for that but guys let's hop right into this gameplay all right we are here on first and 10 and he immediately throws a pick we're not even but a minute into the game and we already get a pick and on first and 10 check this out we find chad ocho cinco wide open for a touchdown I'm telling you guys those plays work miracles man refer back to my money plays video and you will find the exact plays that I'm running in this video as we get a stop right there with the season start left in he throws it in the open finds Larry Fitzgerald this opponent squad wasn't great he had like a lot of base elite players and he also had some silver or bronze cards as well. It's Victor Beasley, man. Get back there for the uh, sack. And we're nearly going to pick the ball right there, forcing a third and 18. And right here, he has a lot of time to throw the ball. Cam is going to take off running with the ball. And he finally goes down at the 41-yard line. After a gain of 15, it's fourth and three. So I had no choice but to send the house. I did not want him to convert this fourth down. And check out the pressure on this play. Clowney comes in with the heat and we force a turnover on downs and on first and 10. Bradford back to throw. We find Chad Johnson deep and we finally go down after a tremendous pickup right there, guys. On first and 10, we're gonna go with another play action pass. This time we find Matthews. Matthews is a great receiver, guys, I'm telling you. He works wonders, man. And on first and 10, Mike Gillisley breaking out in the open field and gets a touchdown as we go up 21 to nothing. I'm sorry, 14 to zero in the first quarter. And we're still sending pressure at this point, guys. On second and 10, has a lot of time to throw. Decides to throw it up deep and it goes out of bounds, but he caught the ball. Harris with a big pickup right there from my opponent on first and 10. Cam Newton scrambling. I have to put someone on spy, man. I have to remember to put someone on spy because lately a lot of quarterbacks have been taking off on me. And on first and 10, Clowney comes through with the pick. That was not a user's right there. Clowney playing his part and getting that interception. Giving us the ball back with six seconds left in the game. And I'm going to go with a play action pass right here. And we're back to throw it. And we go down with the sack. The free safety comes in and gets a big sack right there. Eight yard loss, and we pass it right back to Johnson for another first down. I'm telling you guys, this team is legit. And on third and 10, the craziest thing happens. Here goes Gillisley. Hold on, here we go. Juked him, and he will race to the end zone for his second touchdown of the day. Mike Gillisley has broken out. He's an X factor on my team and we force a fumble. Odell Beckham laying the wood right there and we get the fumble recovery. As I said, guys, Mike Gillisley, check out the juke move again. He's my workhorse, guys. I told you he's legit. You guys need to go pick him up. 16,000 coins. 
heck, man, it's worth it for me. And I'm going to settle for my points right here halfway through the second quarter on fourth and goal, and I'm going to be up 24 to zero. So already I'm trying to pitch a shutout. And on third and four, Newton with a ton of time to throw the ball finally launches it, and Brown, that is a silver linebacker, comes through with his second interception on the day. On third and 20, I decided to go corner strikes, and we're going to find Chad Johnson. I don't know why Iraq caught the ball, but I'm one yard short of the first down. So I'm going to go for it, guys, on fourth and one. And I find Johnson again, breaking tackles, finally going down at the 38. Probably could have went for six. And I, that end of the half, I didn't get nothing from it. And on second and nine, my second possession of the second half, I launch it up for Mike Wallace, and we catch it. Go up 31 to zero. He's chunking it deep again. This time we bat it down, throw it in the double coverage, and it forced him to another fourth and 15. Now he's not punting the ball. He's a savage. He's just going for it, and he has a lot of time to throw again. This time that pass is batted down on fourth and 15, so we're in great field position. We have another opportunity to throw the ball or score on second and eight. Here we go. I find Mike Wallace once again to go in for his second touchdown of the day to put us up 38 to nothing. Already this team is doing big things for me as we get a stop right here on third and seven. I decided to speed it up, man, because I slowed it down on him a bit. I don't want to beat him too bad, man. Uh, but shout out to my opponent, Henry K93, for truly staying in the game, even though he was losing big. On second and seven, I'm checking it up for Chad Johnson, and we throw a pick just when I thought I had the perfect game. I come in and throw a pick, but hey, I had nothing to lose. I was just playing around at this point. And on third and 11, as we enter the halfway mark of the fourth quarter, he catches the football over Odell Beckham. For a touchdown, we go up 38 to 7, and here goes Gillisley. Remember I told you he's breaking out. He's my X factor, and he's finally going to go out of bounds at the 13-yard line. Currently 120 yards on the day, and after this 13-yard run, it puts him at 133 yards on the day. I believe that's his third or fourth touchdown, and that's going to end the game. What a blowout in this game. That marks our first playoff win. We're in the second round of the playoffs, so hey, we had to get it started off right. So guys, if you've enjoyed this gameplay video, please remember to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe for daily videos. As you all know, I keep saying I'm trying to hit 200 subs by the end of the month, so help your boy out. And when you turn on your sub, when you sub to my channel, please be sure to turn on your notifications. I appreciate you guys for rocking with me. Until next time, I'm signing out. Peace.